episode, we're going to talk about gay and lesbian culture, both in the past and how it is still today. We're going to party hard and go to the Gay Oktoberfest in Vienna. We're going to take a city tour with an amazing guide, and we're going to check out bookstores and all the other things that this city has to offer for gay and lesbian culture. So let's go, let's get ready, and let's have fun. I'm so, I'm so So I'm with Andreas, and Andreas is an archivist and a historian about gay and lesbian mm -hmm. culture in Vienna. And this is the first stop on our tour, which is? This is the Kaiserbrunn Lusano, which is a gay bathhouse. Uh, it's 150 years old, but it was always very popular uh, with gay men. Uh, and I'll tell you some stories, especially about the gay brother of Emperor Franz Joseph. Yes. So let's go in. Gay royalty. Let's go. <laughs> Well, here you see uh, the picture of Archduke Ludwig Victor, nicknamed Luzi Luzi. He was the gay brother of Emperor Franz Joseph, and he was a regular guest here. He was very fond of young military man officers uh, that came here. Uh, and um, one day, obviously, he chose the wrong one. So they started to fight. You cannot slap the brother of the emperor. Franz Joseph had a Salomonic solution for this problem. Uh, both were banned from Vienna. Here for the Goga boys. There's a cage. You're probably the first woman in this cage. That's great. <laughs> So this is the legendary Café Berg. Yeah, this is the Café Berg. This was the first uh, gay café that opened during the daytime. Until 1989, uh, Vienna was, at the, was on the edge uh, of Europe. Mm -hmm. uh, and with the fall of the Iron Curtain, suddenly uh, it went into the center. In these years, Vienna opened very much. Uh, but do you feel in general that this is a very gay and lesbian friendly city? Uh, first of all, it is a safe city, yeah, and it, it is an open city, uh, and so it is uh, gay and lesbian friendly uh, as well. Well, and the special thing is uh, next to Café Berg, uh, there is the local gay bookshop uh, here of Vienna, gay and lesbian bookshop now, yeah, bookshop Löwenherz. In English, Lionheart, uh, after the British king Lionheart, the medieval king, yeah, because he supposedly he was gay as well. Well, it's one of the major gay bookstores in the world in the meantime. Well, a lot of people come here to uh, inform themselves about uh, gay and lesbian life here in Vienna. Tourists come here uh, to get the first information, the first impression uh, about the city, have a coffee next door, uh, so this combination uh, is, is quite successful. And look over there, there are the traffic lights with the, with the couples. Wait, uh, this one over here? Yeah, over there. Well, yeah, here, here they are, over there. Yeah. Nice. Less better, yeah. gay couples. Okay, Andreas, thank you so, so much yeah. for taking it me with you. It was fine to walk with you. Yay. Yeah. I have to go party now. But... And I go to relax. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> so have a nice time. See Bye. You, so I'm at Prata. I'm one of my favorite places. We're sitting in the middle of it right now. We're at Rosa Vizan and I have with me the beautiful and the legendary Tamara Mascara. And Hi. you need to tell me where we are and why we're actually here. Well, we're in the middle of Prata, like actually close to the amusement park and also close to the forest part of Prata. And uh, tonight it's the Rosa Wiesenzelt. So it's called the Pink Wiesenzelt, which means uh, we're not only doing our kind of traditional celebrations in there, but it's like traditional celebrations 
gay. So we just overdo it. It's like not only boys are wearing lederhosen, it's like super hot boys are wearing lederhosen. Oh, hell you know? yes. Or like okay. drag queens in, in the jungle, you know, it's like, it's just fun and like over the top. All right. <laughs> Again, we're at a burlesque party, and hopefully, you're gonna tell me what is tonight, what is happening, like what is it? The organizer of the party, Shock Patriot, is inviting the queens from RuPaul's Drag Race to this party, so it's kind of special for Vienna. But actually, in the city, you can experience a party like every week. All right, we're gonna go in. I'm gonna check out what boilers actually means and what they do, and that's my dog. Adventures. We'll see you and I can buy anything.